Hey, guys, look what I got. It's a magic genie speaker that plays music, talks, and no stuff, all without wires. But there's a wire. No more from you, please. All right, let me squish. Breaking news from the Huffington Post. Prince bred purple dolphins. Wasn't there a senator shot this morning? You see, right there. This device is a perfect example of how we continue... That's enough. No, David, I don't like that. No. Sharon, hey, it's Brian Griffin. Wonder I saw it. Is it good? Searching reviews. Top critic on Rotten Tomatoes says, I walked out of the theater and I'm Ed Helms. Okay, no download, but thanks. Maybe you are useful. Go Ono. Oh no, I don't care for this music either, David. Occurred in 1998 at a Hardee's in Memphis by Aretha Franklin. Damn, I owe Chris five bucks. Chris, you were right, it was 98. What are you doing here? Pulling the popcorn bucket trick on myself. I still can't find it. This is humbling. Well, ho hold on, hold on. I didn't buy that. Peter bought that. I know, but I need one. Brian, be positive with your life. Oh, forget it. I'm just gonna lie down on the couch with my head on the armrest to accentuate how sad I am. You know, Brian, if I had, oh, one day in your body, I would give it back. It's our family photo. You're kind of getting in the way. I'm not ducking down. You duck down. You're getting in my way. Stop being a brat and duck down. No way. In fact, I'm standing. Return your body to you. Now, the instructions gave me a couple of options. I chose the one where my voice will be coming from your body and vice versa. Still, from time to time, we will have to imitate the other person. Her maid has broken at some crucial juncture. This one won't. All right, you talk me into it. Okay, here we go. I'll see you on the other side. Of your eyes. Whoa! <laughs> My hand. I mean, your hand. It's mine. Yes! Stewie, I think it worked. It's so heavy. Yeah, you gotta have a wide base. Let the shoulders do more. All right. All right, I think, I think I'm getting it. Okay, I'm off to get you a job, a girlfriend. Who haven't had sex with a student or tweeted about assassinating the president. All right, it's you. Welcome to Poetry 101. I'm Professor Griffin. Please open your book. Ignore that! He didn't know what a frontispiece was! Professor Griffin sucks! It is a frontispiece. <laughs> dating? Is this how dating works? <laughs> You're cute. I like you. Help! She's trying to eat me! Get back here! You owe me a hundred dollars! Oh, really? It's once a week. It's not that bad. It, he really lit up. Oh, and you're gonna hate this, but I gave him the salute. So you're a salute guy now. Well, is he a veteran at least? Does it matter? What? what happened? Stewie? Is that you? Yes, Brian. It's... God, that is a tight belt. How does he live like this? Oh, it's fine. Just look in the mirror. Well, here you go. About to put you in front of the mirror right now. Oh, phew. There I am. Hi, me. But in its system. If I can't fix it, we'll be like this forever. This is a total disaster. Like when the fat man tried to keep Michael Shannon from going insane. Meadows. We now return to a human hand rolling a ball of clay. Yay! Stewie, enough of that. We have to fix the machine. That was close. All right, let's get upstairs and fix... Peter, come in the kitchen. I need your help. What? Huh? I'm watching something. Oh, God, keep him busy. I'll make this quick. How to give his wife an orgasm. Wait, are you saying we have to have sex this weekend? Yep, all weekend long. Now that's... Brian, you've got to help me. Lois signed us up for some perverse PP-related class on the female orgasm. She's crazed! Wow. That's to Weekapog. If we hurry, we can get there before Stewie's scarred for life. Brian, it's only 10.30 a.m. Why does my body crave alcohol? That's perfectly normal for this time of day. I'm sweaty. Female genitalia. Oh, good lord! I mean, va-va-voom, right, other men? 
I'm confused. Get out of here! All right, let's have an inconsistently smashed windshield chase. I was gonna say the whole town. I'm standing here for some reason doing the weather in a giant black man's body. What kind of a Friday is this? Freaky! Oh! Oh no! Oh yeah! Ho ho! It's funny cause different voices are coming out of different mouths! Ha ha! Bunk in the bathroom. Stewie? Brian, where the hell are you? Lois just asked me if I want to see her kid's first apartment. What does that mean, Brian? I'm so frightened and confused. Okay, it's open. All right, now you've got to reverse the voltage orientation and amplify the electron flow to the motherboard. Stewie, just say it in English, or so help me God, I will hang up and make you screw your mom. Switch the black and yellow wire. Okay, got it. I helped. Great, now we need to find an energy source powerful enough to match the electrical surge that swapped the town in the first place. According to my GPS, you're 20 feet from- Brian, hurry! Uh, Stewie, I'm in Chris's body. I'm dragging 230 pounds of lard up a ladder. I'm 215, you liberal dickweed! Uh, uh, uh. Oh, no. You didn't listen to a word Dr. Johan said, did you? No, I did not. I mean, <laughs> the movie Roadhouse. Hey, oh, a dollar. Hey there, Chris. Hi, Mr. Herbert. Selling your old hand-me-downs? Yep. You got anything you used to wear in the summertime? Just these old. Give you a dollar for this. Sold. Brian, where's Rupert? I just left him here to watch my things. Uh-oh. What? Uh, nothing. I... Peter, those are yours. Ten bucks. Two, seven, four, five fifty. Ten. Sold. Second. I would have gone to fifteen easy. I am so stupid. Awesome. Wow, this is just like what happened with Matthew Broderick, except no one's dead. Hey, it's me oh, up. All you gotta do You're is starting to piss me off! Ah! Oh, man, this sucks. I got no license. I can't go anywhere. Well, this is your own... Funny after Kirsty Alley ate Shelly Long. Oh, man, now I can't even watch TV. What the hell am I gonna do all day? It's all right. It's okay. I don't need TV. I'll just make my own sitcom in my head. Now each day my heart is getting bigger. Don't even remember sleeping with that lady, but I did. My black son, he's coming to stay. Air bottle of NyQuil. I know, and it's doing wonders. Come here, puss. Come here. Come here, puss. Hey, this one's cute, huh? And if we buy it, they save a real gorilla in the wild. And if we don't, they kill one. Wow, these guys are playing hardball. You can't just take some Korean-made velveteen primate and call it Rupert. It was an accident. Damn you, Brian! How could you sell Rupert? What you've done is more horrible than sex with Sharon Stone. Wow, that was great. One minute I'm filling up at Chevron, and the next I'm having this license. Look, Peter, it's getting a little annoying having you around the house all the time, so you'll be happy to know I got you your own personal driver. My own driver? Holy crap, that's awesome. Where is he? Six jokes. Nice going, Lois. <laughs> Dad, are you ready? What exactly are you trying to do? It's very simple, Brian. I've taken D.A.B. This house is deserted. He moved. He's gone. Rupert's gone. Wait a minute, look. The moving truck. We're not too late. Am I Bobice? Yes, I am. Well played, worthy adversary. I say, what a bit of serendipity. Now we've got that fellow's address. Let's see. Aspen, Colorado. Well, you can... Look, Stewie, don't you think at some point you're going to have to let Rupert go? 
I mean, you are getting a little old to have a teddy bear. Brian, I'm one. Still? What? Look, I'm not going to keep it that way. Ah, oh, this sucks. Can you believe I'm stuck with Meg driving me around? Dad, it's just you and me in the car. Yeah, don't remind me. It's bad enough I got a suspended life with apple juice. <laughs> Gettysburg, Billy Yanks, the 20th Maine. So many lives lost, all in pursuit of the ideal that no man should be subjugated because of the color of his skin. These boys paid the ultimate bury, but she's been dead for six hours. Oh, man, that's a tough one. What'd she die of? Well, I've seen some bodies that have been dead for uh, six hours. Some of them aren't too bad. Fish out. <laughs> <laughs> hey, Meg, don't be such a hothead. What? Hey, Meg, you sure look hot today. What? <laughs> oh! <laughs> Meg, that was... Awesome! On the road again. Just can't wait. But there's a hundred thousand dollar deposit. Oh God! Looks like we're walking. Wait a minute. It says here you accept cash, check, or a jaunty tune. Well, this rental agreement was drafted back when musicals were. Just in case you don't believe me, ask the man himself, Mr. Kelly. Will you show us? I'll show you. Let's do it. Good. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Because the mountains are the same color as the sky. What? I said be careful because the mountains are the same color as the... Whoa! <laughs> Imagine the dance I'm gonna... Isn't that fun? I got these at Jack's Joke Shop in South Attleboro, Massachusetts. Remember, if it ain't funny, it ain't worth Jack. Ah! Bitch! Hey there. Welcome to the cool side of the pillow. You've had a hard day. Rest that weary head of yours and drift on off to dreamland. <sighs> Rupert! It's... it's Rupert! Stanford, who is it? It's nothing, dear. I'll handle it. I'm sorry, but that bear belongs to Timmy.